you. You're on a roll. That's a double. And that's a triple. The Grey Spark. SWAT. Welcome back, everybody. Crazy Spartan here doing a little gameplay on, um, I think this is Asylum on Halo Reach. Uh, another Forge map. Now, this is actually a really cool little map. Of course, it's based on a sanctuary from Halo 2. Uh, really fun. Uh, had a lot of good times on this map. Um, really well done <laughs> for, for the Forge of the time, man. I, I tell you what, uh, compared to what we have now for Forge, yeah. Um, it's it's kind of sad and pathetic, but uh, right now uh, I still had a lot of fun uh, playing on this map. And of course, Halo Reach is actually where I really began uh, forging um, back in the day, because I I remember uh, sitting up and uh, talking with my brother, and I was like, well, we could make this and that, and uh, try this, and you know, of course, he wasn't all that much into it, but. Um, I was, and I, I really enjoyed uh, the thought and uh, uh, the uh, craziness of, of building your own map um, however you wanted and um, having other people play on it and just, you know, see how it goes. Um, absolutely. I, I love that thought. And uh, Halo Reach is really where it started for me. Now, Halo 3, I did uh, try to forge back in the day in Halo 3. It was just... Ooh, the Halo 3 was very, very cumbersome. It was not a forgiving uh, forge. Oh, there's that revenge medal. Uh, how many people remember that revenge medal? That, to me, was like one of the best medals of all time. Um, personally, I love that, that medal, and I loved Killjoy, and I wish they would return. I don't know why Killjoy was taken out to begin with, because that was like a staple. Um, that was like one of the other ones. It's like you get on that uh, spree, and then someone else takes away from you, and you you get that, uh, or they get that killjoy. And that was always enjoyable. I was like, yeah, sit down, son. <laughs> but anyways, another uh, awesome medal that they had. Um, it's like the killjoy, the revenge, and uh, <laughs> to be honest. And I'm sorry. I'm just going to be sorry about this. I like the yoink. Do <laughs> uh, you guys remember the yoink from Halo Reach? Basically, your your teammate was doing a um, an assassination. And then you come along and you kill that player. And so you stole that kill from him. <laughs> so it says yoink. Uh, also one of my favorite uh, favorite medals. Um, it's kind of kind of sad. I didn't do it very often. But every now and then I did it. Uh, it was more or less by accident, but uh, it was still kind of fun to get. It would it would make him so mad. It's like you get this awesome little assass assassination, and uh, the next thing you know, <laughs> they don't get the kill. <laughs> Yoink! Uh, still, still one of my favorite medals. Uh, but one of the things I loved about Halo Reach, man, and, and loved it still to this day, is just the sheer amount of game modes. And the creativity of the um, Forge community. They made so much uh, crazy stuff. I think this was honestly, uh, I think was the pinnacle of the uh, custom games. Because people loved the custom games. They would create these uh, crazy maps and crazy game types. and um, Because you had all these crazy options and you could do that stuff. Uh, in Halo 5, uh, not so much. I mean, uh, you do have stuff. You can work with a lot of stuff. The scripting is, is amazing. But unfortunately, they're missing a lot of things, like the game types. Just the, the, the game types alone, if they, if they need to add some more. But, uh, we'll, we'll talk about that again in the future. Because I got something planned for uh, uh, talking about Halo 6, especially since Green Skull put out a recent video. And I don't 100% disagree with everything, because I don't. Uh, most of it I do agree with. Um, but at the same time, I think it's kind of a uh, one-sided conversation, especially when you talk with professionals. Um, uh, definitely, uh, they, they have their own opinions, and so do the casual guys, uh, casual community. And I think sometimes that gets ignored a little bit. Um, but, you know... 
we'll see what happens in the future. Uh, is it going to change anything? Probably not, but hopefully it at least allows the people at 343 to, you know, do a little bit of thinking about what's coming up in the next game. But anyways, this has uh, been a pretty fun little match, and I hope you enjoyed it. A little bit of Halo Reach uh, again. Uh, <laughs> don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe down below uh, if you haven't already. And uh, I'm well on my way to completing my goal for the month of December. Thanks again, guys. This is Cray Spartan. I'm out of here. Comment, like, and subscribe.